Good morning! As you can see, I am still in bed. Normally I start these vlogs much later, but I thought I would just show you. You know when I always say oh, I've had a lazy morning? What I mean by a lazy morning is this setup that I'm in bed editing. I'm trying to watch Shrek on Netflix. Shrek the final chapter, but it just keeps popping up saying title not playing. So I can't get that going. But I am three vlog days behind because of the issue I had with getting my... Um, stuff off the phone onto my Mac. So I've been awake since six. It's just got light now. It's like seven o'clock now. And so I'm going to try and get as much editing as I can before Stephen wakes up. He's just asleep down here. I think it's going to be another lovely sunny day, but I, I don't. I think we might skip the beach. I feel like we're kind of done with the beach now. Just the two of us. It kind of gets a bit samey after a while, but. I don't know, we'll see what um, Stephen thinks when he wakes up. Okay, I'm going quite well. It is 7.48 and I have got one video edited. It is just exporting out. I couldn't get Shrek to work in the end, so I'm watching Life. David Attenborough, kind of wildlife -y thing. The problem I have now is that I have an hour whilst this exports out that I can't do anything else, I don't think. That's a pain, because I want to just crack on with the next edit. Still asleep, of course. Things are still going very productively. I am on my second edit now, about halfway through my second edit. I've got one edit uploading. I've had a shower, washed my hair. Stephen's now awake, finally. Watching some videos. We have a little cat in here. He's not you. No. He's he just won't sit down. He's just like, hello, you. Hello. <laughs> This is the one we call Sneaky, that sneaks in it. Oh, my stomach's rumbling then. <laughs> right, I'm going to get back to this edit. Try and get them all done. It is, what time is it? It's not even 10 o'clock yet. It's like quarter to 10. Yeah. Done loads of work today. Yeah. Oh, is he not staying Yo. with you? Sit down. <laughs> oh, he's up. No, he doesn't want to sit down. Sit. Sit down. He just wants to wander and explore. Sit. And we have to chuck them out because they go in like mess with things and stuff. Second edit of the morning. Done. We finally made our way out. We were kind of contemplating what to do. And we kind of, with, I think we're just going to head kind of into town. Um, I don't know, there's not actually <laughs> an awful lot. So, just popping some things in the bin. Um, not actually an awful, if we don't go to the beach. We don't really want to do anything like go too far or anything particular. Well, I don't anyway, do you? Like, do you want to go to fetch or anything? Yeah. No, no, we kind of don't really want to go too far or anything. So I think we're just going to hang around here, have a little wander, a little walk around, maybe grab some late lunch or something somewhere. Today is actually our last day here. We are flying away tomorrow. Stephen's looking forward to some good internet. Yeah. Internet has been a little bit of an issue here for us at times. We've decided to walk a different way. We normally just go straight down the main road. But we figured we'd go kind of like a back way. We don't really know where we're going. But just to have a little explore around. We've stumbled across some um, a noisy bike. Some no, sheep. Don't the lambs. Oh, are they are little lambs actually, aren't they? They're not that little to be quite honest. Where are they gone? At the back, the little yeah. ones. Aw. Mm -hmm. Hello. Okay. Oh yeah, that's the lamb. He's quite, quite big now though. Oh. We think that maybe there's just going to be some houses down this street. But, hey, it's a nice day for a little walk in the sunshine. What have you spotted? An animal. Is it a cat? Oh, hello. No. Oh. We're just walking along by this um, like little brook. And there was a crazy noise. It's stopped now because I think we've scared them. And we're like, what is that? What on earth is that sound? So like, it's chickens. It's turkey. Stephen was like, no, it's not. And it, we've just walked over. It's Look. frogs. There's absolutely... Wait, there's the one there. They were so loud. You want to hear one every so often? There's loads of them. It's like being in Nana's back garden. Sparky and Lightning would have a field day. Our cat's at home. Like trying to chase the frogs. There. There's a couple over there. There's two there. Is there? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, they both jumped. Whoa. We scared them. 
There's this one there as well. That's one there. It just popped out. We're all going quiet, isn't that funny? Because we've come over, so they've stopped. Oh, oh wow, yeah, there's loads of tadpoles. Well, literally, there's just every time we're walking along, there's loads just of fogs just jumping Look. along. There's loads of tadpoles down there as well. Oh my goodness, there's just going to be so many fogs. Hundreds and hundreds. Do you remember when we had fogs yeah. spawn in our garden? Not many, not many actually survived, do they, Dad? No. My goodness, we were just talking about the, all the fogs when we had fogs spawn in our house. Yeah, well, at my mum's house. And one year, and so, so many of the fog spawn, like, became, like, tadpoles and then little fox. And I'm not joking, they were, like, the size... Do you not remember them at all? Yeah. I even can't remember. But they were, like, the size of my little fingernail, these little frogs hopping all over the glass. There were so, so, so many of them. They were so cute. I'm not a frog fan particularly, but little ones are quite cute. <laughs> so many tadpoles, it's unbelievable. Bless oh, bless you. I think Stephen might be allergic to dogs. She's putting it out there. Oh, oh <laughs> she jumped off. Yeah. And he made that little clown. That's Whoa. so amazing. It reminds us of the rats in um, Hoi An. Rice when we were in, in the Hoi An rice paddies. There were so many rats and they were just diving. It was, it was pretty gross. But that's what the frogs are like, diving into the water. It's like being a little wildlife expedition. We've got goats now. So we've seen goats, chickens. Frogs, sheep. That's it. That's it. Yeah, that, actually, yeah, we've not seen that many. Chickens are over there, by the way, in case you're wondering. Look what else we just found—a huge tortoise. Another, tiny there's one. There's another one over there. That's the one we spotted first, but I don't know if they were able to see that right there by my finger. And as we were looking, we saw this big one in all this junk. We've made it into like the little town bit now. I was just saying, who was looking at us? See if we're the bus. Oh, the bus. Um, yeah, just some little wonder. And to be honest, it's kind of, everywhere it's closed really. And it's kind of, we were just saying, it's kind of just typical English holiday place really. There's no like authentic turkey here. It's just the whole thing is just set up purely like English. Um, English toys, like they're like naff, crappy little shops and things, and I don't really like all of that to be honest. I like more authentic places. Most I don't like it here. I do like it. Here. It's gorgeous, but like this, like this little town, but particularly, we found somewhere. I think we're gonna go here. It's kind of like one of the only, well, the only place that we found open. So <laughs> this is where we're gonna go. This, this is our waiter. <laughs> I think, Mama? yeah, no, his dad, his dad's gone out, his dad owns it, I think. Oh, look, ooh, ooh, nice, thank you. <laughs> oh, well, this is quite nice. Stephen's got a little mate to play with, and I can sit in the sun. Is it too sunny and warm for tag? <laughs> oh, on the floor there. Oh, is it nice to have someone to play with though? Oh, great, look at this car. Oh, he's just moved. Kids disturbed him. He was sitting how our cat sit at home, like with their paws up in the air. Hey, you! Is it a hard life? Catch up your hands. Hey. <laughs> oh. Hey. Time hey. out. Time out. We finished there. It was kind of well, kind of a disaster, but kind of quite nice as well. There was um, we went there for something to eat, but they weren't serving food. The chef. I didn't really understand it. The chef had to take his wife into fete or something, I don't really know. But anyway, they weren't serving food today. 
we haven't eaten yet. It's about three o'clock in the afternoon, and we've had not. We've had anything? No, I haven't. I uh, know we've had nothing at all to eat yet, and it's three o'clock. But on a positive note, it was lovely and sunny. There was a, a little boy there for Stephen to play with, so he played with him. But we are now going. Well, we don't know really. We're just going to wander and see if we can find something somewhere to eat because we're really hungry. We're probably going to go back to Abracababra where we went the other day. The food, to be honest, wasn't that amazing, I didn't think. But it's kind of like, you haven't really got many options really, so probably where we're just going to go. No one else is open. Also, it's three o'clock and it's not been mentioned. What day it is today, Stephen? What day is it today? Mother's Day. Oh, so you do know? Yeah. Oh. I was like, does he even know it's Mother's Day? Is he even bothered? It's Mother's Day? You did know it's Mother's Day. Yeah. So you're gonna pay yeah, for not really. You're gonna he's gonna buy me a meal, you're gonna pay for my meal. Yes, yeah, hello you go, he's gonna take me out. With your pocket money? Yeah. That's nice. I need to phone my mum actually as well when we get to where we're going. We've got a bit of Wi Fi, there was no Wi Fi at that place, so I couldn't phone her. So happy Mother's Day. This is going out after Mother's Day, like probably like four days after Mother's Day by the time I sort myself out with Wi-Fi and editing and all that garbage. But yeah, I hope you all had a wonderful Mother's Day. All the mums out there. I'm having a lovely one. It's very sunny. I hear that it's very sunny back in England as well. If we were home, I was speaking to my mum last night, if we were home... If we were home now. Uh, <laughs> if we were home now. If we were home, it's unfortunate. We did try, we wanted to get home for Mother's Day. Um, because my sister, uh, my sister lives in London and she's going to Norway. She was back home in Ormskirk and uh, it would have been nice. She left last night back to London to go to Norway for like a week, two weeks, I don't know. And so it would have been nice if we could have got home. We were like on Friday or Saturday morning. And then, is it Saturday? No, it's not Saturday today. And then, and then I could have seen my sister. We could have had Mother's Day and stuff because we would have had a barbecue. There is nothing I just absolutely love. Nobody, well, I don't really think that anybody else in my family loves the whole barbecue scene as much as I do. My dad used to appreciate it when he was alive, bless him. He used to love a good barbecue. There's nothing more that I love than like a sunny day, sunny Sunday, friends, family round, cooking a barbecue, and I don't even eat meat. I just love it. Is this the place? Yeah. yeah. We're here. I'm just giving my mum a quick ring, see if she's around, just to wish a happy Mother's Day. What time is it? It is. Oh, I think the clocks went back hello. in England, or what clocks went forward? Oh, hello. Okay, finished the conversation with my mum. That went on a little bit longer than I anticipated. I got. Um, a toasty, which randomly comes with sliced oranges. I mean, I'm not complaining, that's quite nice. And um, we've got a salad, some mushrooms. It seems got a chip button. Terrible. We're leaving, we're on our way home. It's such a glorious day. The mountains look so beautiful. We're gonna go. Oh, yeah. He's waving to us, that man. Did you wave to it? That man in that car was just waving, like, really, like, ferociously waving like ferociously is that a word yeah yes. that, that's not the right word though is it vigorously anyway um we need to nip to the shop uh -huh. we yeah and buy some cat food oh. Oh, yeah. oh yeah look there's the bus going down to our denise like, what, we should walk down here i mean we're not canoe now no well no we're done before Stephen got a magnum. I got this, which is a twister, but it's marshmallow flavour. I have never in my life seen a pink twister marshmallow, so we're going to give oh, it a whirl. Well, a blue, yeah, there's a blue one. It was like ocean flavour, so we didn't really understand what that was. How pretty is that? Little pink and white striped. I have a feeling that I'm not actually going to like it. That mar marshmallow is always one of those things that I think is going to be really delicious. But it's always too sweet. It's not too bad. Right, we're going home. 
We just got back. Just been playing with the dogs. I'm catching that for a little bit. We're gonna um it's quite early, but we're gonna chill for maybe an hour. Watch an episode of Blacklist on Netflix and then um we'll be doing a bit of packing and stuff and also gonna spend a little bit of time with um with Linda before we leave. You got it. Yeah. The good Samaritan. We're on episode 11. Oh, there's loads. Yeah. Whoa. My God. Quite a full. Quite a Wow. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh wow. Oh, well, we're going to watch something. Something went wrong. We've been trying to watch an episode of Blacklist. We it's are. So <laughs> we're about the thing is, it's like, what is it, like a 45 minute, 50 minute programme? But it probably takes us about two hours to watch it because of like the buffering and stuff. It <laughs> literally does take twice the time, doesn't it? Um, so yeah, we're kind of halfway through that. And I have started packing. Like, I mean, that is the start of the packing. It, what I mean by starting packing is getting I'm just stuff. like literally just getting everything from around the room. How I, how I pack when we're leaving is just get everything from around the room that belongs to us, dump it in a pile there. And then organise it. So oh, for the rest no. of the evening, we're probably just going to try and watch Blacklist. I'm going to pack a bit and stuff. Sitting here? Alright. You weren't doing like that. I'm not doing that. I don't know. <laughs> Being an idiot. Right, I'm going to go. So uh, <laughs> he's doing some stupid things behind the camera. Yeah, but anyway, Sitting thank you for watching. I think this is the first vlog I've actually ended in days. <laughs> Ah, got yeah. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching. And we'll see you tomorrow when we are leaving. Goodbye.